Welcome back to Active Duty Outdoors. I'm finally getting the old town out on the water. I've had it for about, I don't know, five months now. Just finally got it rigged up. Finally finished moving down to Navarre. Uh, for those that didn't know, we, we got rid of the Freedom Farm and now we're living the beach life. Don't ask me why, don't ask me how, just kind of happened. So we're gonna check this thing out, get on the water, see if we can't go get some sheep's head today. Went down to Half Hitch, down at a little local tackle store. Picked me up some fiddlers because I'm still new to the area and I don't know where the heck the fiddlers are. So we're gonna find them, we're gonna check them out. Let's do it. All right, we're out here. Finally, it took me a while to figure this thing out. I thought tearing my battery all apart, trying to figure out why I couldn't get started. But it's because I had the kill switch out. I used to having to work the kill switch, so we're gonna check this thing out. Right now I'm spot locked. I'm gonna go drive around. I got some, some bait that I gotta go drown. And with a lithium battery, I also have this uh, Renergy battery monitor. It tells you how much voltage you're drawing or how many amps you're drawing and how much life you have left. And if I was to go at this speed, I can make this battery last for the next 13 hours. As you can see right there. So these normal battery monitors on the Minn Kotos, they don't work with lithium batteries. So you gotta get something that works with your lithium. Last thing you wanna do is run your battery dead and be stuck. That wouldn't be fun. All right, we're heading right over here to these docks. So this is the main reason why I wanted one of these Old Town Autopilots. So I could sit right here by these pilings, have this thing spot lock me. And just wait for the fish to come in. My last kayak, it was way too hard with a paddle. Might be a lot easier with a pedal, but a paddle kayak get out there ain't no way to do it the current and the tide constantly pulling you and taking you away for this guy i'm just just sitting here drowning baits i think the next one i'll get is a pedal that'd be pretty cool have a autopilot and a pedal kayak come on now that's too easy I'm Came back, dropped it in. Oh no. Come on. Oh, this boy's big. What are ya? Got him right under the boat. Get him away from that boat, oh, Nilly. Who's out this way? Which way you go, buddy? Oh, big old drum. Come on, buddy. You're coming up here. Come on, buddy. That's one in the net. Dang, that joker wasn't playing. Looks 
like he's a keeper. Live drumming pretty good to eat. Not bad. See if we can do it again. Well, that was pretty awesome. That was the first fish in our uh, old town autopilot. Black drum. All right, that was a pretty good little maiden voyage. At least we uh, caught a fish, which is good. If I would have came out here and not caught anything, I would have uh, probably sold this old town. Just can't keep it because it's nice. It's pretty awesome. I'm a little remote. Go around. We're gonna head back in. The girls are about to get out of school. I got one fish. That's good enough for dinner tonight. And uh, we'll be back out. The water's a little choppy today. So maybe next time we come out, it'll be a little bit more calm. All right. Anyways, don't forget to hit the like, hit the subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next one. Well, there's my first fish in Navarre. I don't know what the heck he's doing going after a... Look at that guy. Make good bait.